What's this? Hector's happy thoughts? Oh, I ain't happy. Ugh. There. These are just my thoughts. Hello. I am Hector, and I took the time to put together all my thoughts that I have learned from personal experience. Well, because you need to know them. Now listen up. Thought number one. If you ever find yourself using a power drill, make sure your feet are firmly planted. If you don't, you'll end up spinning all over the place. Yeah, all right, now, let's see now. Thought number two. Now, if you ever find yourself in the middle of a pack of hippopotami, don't ever hey, try Hector. to- Hey, uh, Oh, Pastor Steve. How you doing, man? Uh, oh, uh, uh, how did you know I was here? Well, I, I just came over to borrow a hammer, and I noticed on the garage door, there's a great big sign that says, there is nothing happening here, which probably means there's definitely something happening here. So I just came in to see what was going on. Oh man, I thought that would throw people off. Well, it threw Winston off because he's been looking for you all day long. Yeah, yeah, well that's good. So what exactly are you doing? Well, I'm working on something. Yeah, what are you working on? It's a video of all my thoughts. Wow, so would you mind sharing a few of your thoughts with us? Okay, here, uh, let's see, let's go back to uh, thought number three. <clears throat> if you ever see a cat up in a tree, do not try and help them down. Um, Hector, are these thoughts based on personal experiences? Oh, yes they are. Hector, why would you leave the cat in the tree? Because that cat had to learn his lesson about not climbing in trees. Well, okay, I, I understand that, but but you are the cat's protector. You're supposed to keep the cat safe from harm. Well, now, why should I protect that cat? I mean, no one's looking after me. Oh, come on, Hector, that's not true. Oh, yeah? Well, does anyone at Scuffin' in look out for me? No, sir. I don't have a protector. Oh, come on. Actually, you do have a protector. Uh, who, Winston? <laughs> no, it's not Winston. Think about that time that you were in outer space and you went, all the way out there and came back to Earth safe? Who do you think was with you and who do you think helped you return safely back to Earth? Oh, uh, Han. But who gave Han the brain that helped you guys get home safely? Uh, God. Exactly. God protects us from lots of things. God protects us all the time. And a lot of the times we don't even know that God is there protecting us, but he is. Just like with Moses, when God protected Moses when he was going down the Nile River, Moses didn't know that God was there. Moses was just a baby, but God was still there and he was protecting Moses and God is our protector today. Well, I guess I should probably go get that cat then. I mean, keep him from harm and protect him and all that. You, you mean the cat is still in the tree? Oh yeah, he's been there for a couple of weeks now. Winston keeps bringing him milk. I mean, he seems okay to me. Well. I, I really think, Hector, you should go take care of that situation. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh wait, you wanna hear my sign off line? Oh, I've been yeah. working on this. I'd love to, let's hear it. Okay, <clears throat> I am Hector, and these were my thoughts. Bye now. That's it? We're done. <laughs> How long exactly have you been working on that? Well, since I lost that cat. So you've been working on that for weeks now? Oh, uh, yes, sir. Huh.